Hi everyone, thanks so much for coming back to my channel. This is Tina with Tina's Craft Creations. On today with a small uh, scrapbook.com haul. So, as you can tell, I got more Good Vibes paper. <laughs> um, after I was playing with it when I was doing my um, swap with Karen, I just decided to do some searching online to see if I could find more paper. Not that I'm running low, but I just wanted to like replenish what I did use. Um, Scrapbook.com was the only website that I could find that had 12 by 12 paper pads. They had four left in stock. I ordered two. <laughs> so um, if you're looking for this collection, you can at least find a couple paper pads on Scrapbook.com if they're still available. Um, so I got two more of these. I'm just going to do a very quick flip through because I'm sure most of you have seen this, especially if you've been around on my channel for a while because this is my favorite collection and I do haul it pretty frequently. Um... It's my favorite, and I will continue to buy it if I find it, because it's really hard to find. Um, it's getting more and more difficult to find. This is one of my favorite paper uh, papers from this collection. I think it's so fun. Uh, love this collection so, so much. This one's my favorite, obviously. Um, but yeah, if you are looking for this paper pad then head on over to, and it repeats, scrapbook.com. They might still have a couple left. All right, in addition to that, I did order a couple of dies. Um, I found a bunch from this Paper Rose Studio who I've ordered from before, and I really like their, I really like their dies. Um, sorry, I had to clap at Joplin. She's chewing on something. Um, I got this rose uh, die. I think this is really pretty. This will be pretty for layering. Um... I also got this tiny little bow die. I think this will be really cute for some embellishments that I have in mind. So, got that one. Um, I got this one that says, uh, awesome. It's a little layering die with, uh, the background and the fonts. Uh, I got this one for, it says friend. I thought these would come in handy for, like, embellishments. Like, just year-round kind of embellishments. And I got this one that says hugs. I got this one that says dream. I got this uh, triangle die. thought this would be cool for some fun embellishments in a different shape. Um, I got this one as well for some fun embellishments. And I love all of the detail on this, these. Um, yeah, so it has the like, nice detail and stitching. And then the last one I got is this really cute little house die set. These can obviously be cut and used for embellishments with Maggie Holmes' collection, since she does um, feature houses so much in her collections. Um, this just reminds me of Amsterdam. <laughs> um, there's all different types of uh, buildings or homes with these different types of um, architectural elements. Um, but yeah, I got that. And then um, the last thing I got is just the free gift that came with my order, and then is these flat alphas that were thrown in under the, these are scrapbook.com alpha stickers. I'll just throw these in a D stash. I don't use flat alphas. So that is my quick little uh, scrapbook.com haul. If anyone has any questions, please let me know. If you've not already, I'd greatly appreciate if you would consider subscribing and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone.